morning guys look at what we're doing today we have rented mopeds and we're about to cruise the town and i'm so excited and we're all sweating like crazy so Yo, we have to get on the road send it, send it. <laughs> you guys silly i'm still gonna send it we gotta go because i'm like literally dripping and i hope you can't tell <laughs> nothing ever comes to me yeah. in a steady street it scares me. That's so cool. So our first stop is at Coconut. We're getting coconut water, so I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's big splash. So good, so refreshing. Yes. <laughs> Just, it's so small. <laughs> it's so sad. But you gotta keep on going. You gotta live that. So guys, we just had a wonderful time at the pool. We took a break from riding the mopeds because we were just absolutely dying. It was so hot. We were probably getting more burnt and we just needed a break. So it was really nice to just like go to the pool for a bit. It's awesome to have one at our condo. And now we're ready and we're going out for dinner. We still got our sweet rides over here. And if we hurry, we can also catch the sunrise because see that, see that golden hour right there? That means the sun is going down, we gotta go. Guys, somebody else decided to join me. This beautiful girl, look at her. She looks so cute in her outfit. Thanks, babe. You're welcome. I think I'll look even cuter on this moped. <laughs> Dang, girl, you make that moped look so good. <laughs> okay. uh, not so much with the dancing. Why don't you tell them about your whip? What? Zero to 60 and how fast? <laughs> what? 15 seconds? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, these things are really slow. They're actually classified as bicycles here, right, Ayla? Apparently. Returned our scooters. So sad, our mopeds. But um, I think that the company was pretty great. Um, they gave us like a proper lesson. Like we were with him for like an hour or so before, and apparently that's kind of like a big deal here because a lot of places just like let you, let you go. Yeah. So in order to be safe, we felt really good about that. Um, but yeah. If you guys come to Maui and you're in Kihei, go to, or is it Maui, Maui Scooter, Scooter Rental? Shack. Scooter Shack. The Maui Scooter Shack, guys. <laughs> and we had Bashar. we had this guy and he was great, so. Yeah, Bashar. Tell um, Bashar we sent you. <laughs> 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 He'll, he won't know what you're talking yeah. about. <laughs> we didn't give names. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, now we're off to the road to Hana. It's our last full day. We are plan to make the most of it. So excited. Yes. Yeah. Let's get some water and get on the road. Yes. Yeah. All right guys, we've started on our first location. We found this sweet spot just off the side of the road, which we're pretty sure ends with a beautiful waterfall or something, more than likely anyway. But we've come across a bit of a roadblock with a small family here. Just uh, holding down the fort. If you can make it through them, you get to experience the waterfall. This could be the last you hear from us. Don't worry guys, I eat plant-based. <laughs> Than, like, with oh my goodness. They're just cows. Well, we went to a different spot because the last one didn't really work out, and we found another waterfall, and people are jumping off of it. We stopped at this place called Auntie Sandy's, and it has banana bread and it's literally still warm it's super good really, yeah, so really we good. bought two because we had to indulge like, one to take home though when you're out here and so take home like on the plane no like the condo is home. okay okay <laughs> yeah so one for tonight pretty much and it's it's been really good if you guys are out doing the road 
Make sure you stop at Auntie Sandy's. It's kind of off the road. Uh, what's the road we came down? Do you remember? All your emotions with your heart on your sleeve. It won't fade until you paint it black. I let it burn. You call the fire brigade, but I feel that it will come back. Oh. like a huge one over there and then we found this little one with like a pool here and we're just gonna hang out but it's so pretty and there's nobody here we have it all to ourselves it is perfect oh and Caleb's changing Woo! Woo! get naked <laughs> get naked get naked 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 afraid oh gosh <laughs> Caleb and Ayla stayed at the car. Ayla wasn't feeling too hot, but it's really it's getting dark out. We're trying to make it to Wei Moku Falls. Get some shots for Ayla and Caleb. We've probably done about 0.8 miles of a jog. Yeah. Still got a bit to go. We're gonna so, keep going. See you in a bit. So, yeah, we're just about to enter the bamboo forest, and we're told it's pitch black in there. Going for it, anyways. Some falls here. Gorgeous. I wish we could share with Aileen and Caleb, but we're gonna get as much footage as we possibly can for them. And here we go, entering the pitch black, dark bamboo forest. A little scary, but we can do this for Aileen and Caleb. Woo! <laughs> okay. We made it. Uh, that was the scariest jog of my life. Scariest. We're sweating buckets, but. I think it's worth it. Hopefully you guys can see it. Hopefully. That is 400 feet high. That's amazing. 400 feet. Unbelievable. It's absolutely gorgeous. It was worth the scariest jog of my life. That's 400 feet tall. I've never seen a more gorgeous hike and we live in the Canadian Rockies. Like, it's amazing. We need to use cool off take some pictures for them, and get out of here before we literally have no moonlight left. We came super early to this beach. Today's our last day, but we really wanted to see some turtles before we left, and we did. We came to, can you help me say it? Paella. Oh, paella. And then the beach. No, paella. Paella. 
and then we came to the beach here that's famous for the turtles because they come up um, at night to rest and like you can see their markings but there's two left there's two left and i bet you there was probably 15 or 16 earlier this yeah, morning yeah so i recommend i guess coming at sunset um is really good because that's when they're when they start coming up and they're resting and yeah. everything but oh it's so cute <laughs> so right there all those markings those were all turtles just laying on the beach and then there's one there if you can tell the other guy just moved his head a little you can't see them because the rocks have they to blend in so good so yeah there is this rope here because uh, you need to give them lots of space. When I was young, I thought control would lead me to an ending road. And heavy metals seem to be the only Tell me it looks so crazy. <laughs> I don't ever say that to a woman. <laughs> okay, we're at the airport and we are going home. We're really sad. It's so sad. Because it's time to leave and I'm I not ready. The end. I could use at least another week. <laughs> at least. Or a year or two. I could probably stay here by the way. Yeah, I know. I'm probably going to uh, eventually. <laughs> we'll see. But we're super sad. But we had such a good time. And honestly, I'm so excited to see Ellie. So I'm, yeah. pretty, I'm excited to get home. But it's going to be another long travel day. Like a long travel day. So, so get home tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's 5.30 in Hawaii, which means 9.30. Yeah. Yeah. yeah 9.30 back home. And we get there at 10.30 tomorrow morning. Yeah. It's going to be long. But it's going to be a long day. It's okay. We'll we got movies through, loaded and we're ready to go. Mm -hmm. And knowing us, it's like all kids' movies too. Yeah. Disney for the win. <laughs> but hopefully the next time you see us, we'll be somewhere further along in our journey. Yeah.